at approximately 722 this morning, resources from Los Angeles County Fire Station 106 received a report of a solo vehicle accident at the intersection of Hawthorne Boulevard and Paulus Verdes Drive North in Rolling Hills Estates. Upon arrival of the scene of the incident with sheriffs on scene, uh, resources and personnel from the Los Angeles County Fire Department observed a single rollover vehicle incident with one person trapped. The person trapped uh, uh, was extricated by the Los Angeles County Fire Department personnel. Earlier, it was stated that the jaws of life was utilized to extricate the person trapped. It was later determined by our personnel that a hologan tube, which is used for prying, and an ax was also used to pry the person free from the vehicle. The person was packaged at the incident in stable condition with serious injuries, and because of the fact that they needed to be extricated, they were transported to Harbor UCLA Hospital because of the extrication, and Harbor Hospital is also a trauma center. As indicated earlier, there's also a second vehicle accident with no injuries. Thank you. Uh, joining me now is Kent Paisley. He's a golf reporter in the Bay Area in California. Uh, Kent, good to have you on the program with us. Of course, uh, the whole world has been stunned by this crash, and we certainly send uh, all our hopes and best thoughts uh, for Tiger Woods and, and, and are thinking of his family right now. Uh, talk to us about what's been the reaction to this news in the sports world. It feels like such a full circle for Tiger. You know, he started his golf career in Southern California, started the, you know, tender young age of, age of six months old playing golf at the Navy course in, in near San Diego. And it's just been such a, such a shock. You know, this had echoes initially, initially of what happened to Kobe, Kobe Bryant tragically a year ago. ago. Fortunately, we've, we've seen more reporting that it's not life, life threatening, but most of the world is the sports was just hoping he can get back to to early a life after his third third back surgery in 2015 he talked about he couldn't walk, walk. and that, that's probably another question facing him as it's been, been reported that he's facing multiple leg injuries